guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a newborn essentials video and also breastfeeding essentials. There's a few things that I wanted to uh, let you guys know about for breastfeeding as well. Nova is here, so if you hear noises in the background, it's just her talking. So I'm going to start with the breastfeeding essentials and then I'll kind of just go into the nursery and show you guys the newborn things. Okay, so the obvious one uh, is a nursing pillow. And I use this definitely a lot at the beginning of with my breastfeeding journey, but I feel like as time has gone on, I've used it a little bit less and just will use pillows or I've just figured out the hold a little bit better. But I definitely think it's really good to use when you're first learning and first getting the hang of it. Um, so a nursing pillow. One of the ones that I'm sure you've probably already heard of because it gets talked about all the time online is the Haka. And it's just this like suction, a breast pump and you just like suction it on um, when you're often when you're nursing on the other side you can suction it on the one that you're not nursing on and you can collect breast milk that might otherwise be leaking or whatever and it's just really handy this is just like the stopper so that if you were to knock it over it stays in which has come in handy and it also has a suction base so that's good um, so this definitely get yourself one of this one of these I have two actually because if one's dirty then I can use the other one because I find them so useful nipple cream or nipple butter I just have this um, one from Earth Mama but at one point um, things got really bad and I had to be prescribed like this magical cream so I find this just for like an everyday use and then I use like the magic cream when I really needed it this is a breastfeeding nursing cover but it also doubles as a car seat cover so it just goes over um, your head and then you can peek in. I like it because it's lightweight and everything and for the car seat cover, it's been windy here so it protects her from the wind um, and then it acts as a nursing cover. So I just have it in my bag, diaper bag at all times and then I can use it for whatever one of the uses I need. This is from the brand Copper and Pearl and I just got it off Amazon. Now something that's definitely not necessary but I have really loved having it is this like backrest pillow. I use it for nursing um, whenever I'm in the bed. It just actually helps support my back a lot better than just a regular pillow. So I've loved having that. And the other really cool thing has been this little light. So it just sits on this like charging station here and you just tap it to turn it on. And then you press and hold to make it brighter, press and hold to make it light less bright. And this thing has been like the best because it's not so bright, but it gives enough light and it's really handy if you have one hand um, holding her and you just need one hand and you don't have to fiddle with the switch. It's definitely really, really handy. And then these are reusable nursing pads and they're really bulky so I only really use them when I'm around the house, but I like that I can wash them and then I feel like I'm not um, using as much waste and then I have the like disposable ones for when we go out because they're a little less bulky um, so those are good too another thing that isn't really a product well kind of I did order some online and then I'm going to be making myself um, some here at home but it's lactation cookies I find that they actually really work and so if you're struggling with your supply or you just need a little extra boost um, those are really good do you want to say hello <laughs> she has the hiccups poor thing and I just got spit up on so that brings me into the newborn essentials receiving blankets <laughs> we have receiving blankets everywhere in every single room in the house because you never know when you're gonna need them oh yeah do you see that <laughs> Okay, we're just gonna roll with the spit up shirt <laughs> and keep going. Some things that are essentials that I've loved having uh, that are usually in her nursery. So definitely the nose Frida. We were just talking about this in a vlog. Um, it's just a nose sucker thing and you use your mouth and it sounds so gross, but it really works really well. Another thing is this no touch thermometer. It is really handy so far to find the right temperature for the bath because that way it's not too hot, not too cold. That was something I, wor I was worried about, was making sure that she would be comfortable in there. And so this has helped. I've really been loving this ointment. It's Burt's Bees All Purpose Ointment. We use this as like a diaper rash cream and then when we need something more heavy, we will use the Desitin uh, and it's just like a zinc based 
zinc oxide based cream as for socks I was gifted these at the baby shower and these are the best like brand of socks. They're called Rubies and they're like designed to stay on and they're the only kind that actually stay on baby's feet. Every other kind just falls off or gets kicked off really easily. So those are good. Sleepers is a big one for newborns. Uh, you find that that's really what you like to keep them in to be just comfy and because you're around the house a lot. Uh, this one's from Old Navy and it's really soft and cozy. But yeah, mostly sleepers I'd say. As for like just regular onesies and stuff, we haven't been using them quite as often as sleepers. But what I do like is these kimono style ones uh, because you can actually put them on just like how you would a sleeper. It doesn't have to go on over the head. So Nova doesn't love when things go over her head. So these come in handy for that. Swaddle blankets, I really love the stretchy, like soft ones like this. This is Copper Pearl and this one is Mebby Baby. And I like these way better than like muslin blankets. Because of the stretch, you can really get a tight swaddle. So those are good. We have this play mat and she loves to hang out on it. And this is where we usually do our tummy time. So any kind of play mat is really, really good. But I'll link this one down below too because it is really, really cute and she loves it. And then of course the diaper genie. We really love our diaper genie. I think it works really well. We honestly haven't noticed the room getting smelly or anything and it's really easy to use and so I really like it. As for pacifiers, we actually bought several of these kinds. This one just is on the Web and Up, but we bought several of these and I find that Nova has a hard time like keeping it in her mouth. Um, so we also have this like bit, I think it's called bibs and she really likes this one. It actually stays in her mouth and doesn't fall out quite as often. And then we've been trying the MAM pacifiers lately as well. And so far so good. But I would suggest uh, if you're going to try pacifiers, don't buy too many of one because your baby might not like it or it might fall out or might not work as well. So you might have to try like a few different brands. You are going to need a bathtub or some way to bathe baby. And so we use this thing and it's like a seat that goes in our bathtub. It's called, I think it's called Angel Care. Yeah, Angel Care. <laughs> I had to stop and help her out. But yeah, like I was saying, we really like um, the bathtub that we got or the bath support because it can like grow with her. We could use it right when she was a newborn and we'll be able to use it for quite a while. Whereas those like tubs, they, as soon as your baby's too big, they're too big. So we like that one. Another important thing is a stain remover. This OxyClean baby is what we've started using and it actually works. It actually gets the poop stains out of the onesies and out of basically any and everything so that is a huge essential in our house because otherwise we would be in serious trouble <laughs> so Nova sleeps in our room with us and we use the halo bassinet and so this is what it looks like we have the one with different controls so it has a light sound um, this little function is you can press it when you're breastfeeding and it just sets off an alarm and reminds you after 30 minutes um, if you've fallen asleep or anything so that you remember to put the baby back and then this is vibration and it swivels and moves around and this part actually goes down so that you can like reach in and easily grab baby. And so far I've really loved it and Nova sleeps really great in this. She actually like last night, she, you guys, she slept eight hours. <laughs> it was amazing, it was real good. Now the things that we usually use downstairs on the main level, one thing is this bouncer that we just recently got. It is an automatic bouncer because a lot of them actually aren't automatic and you have to like push it with your hand or your foot or whatever. Um, so I definitely wanted one that was automatic, uh, but she really likes this one. It's cozy as a newborn insert and it works really well. It's by the brand Ingenuity. And then one thing that I did that I have been finding really, really useful, is I put together this diaper caddy and filled it with essentials that I can keep down on this level and that way I don't have to be going upstairs all the time. So diapers, wipes, um, blankets and things like that. But the one thing that's really crucial is this change mat. So I'll often like lay it out right here on the couch and change her on it and it has a waterproof side and it has worked really well. She has had a full on pee and poo explosion on here and it has saved our couch and our bed. So that has been great. Yes, I'm talking about you little girl. 
Also, these Boone drying racks are really, really handy for all of your like bottles and bits and pieces for pumps and stuff. So that one is really good too. And then the last thing that I wanted to mention is a baby wrap. I have this one from Boba, but there are so many good brands out there. And I think that these are really great, especially for the newborn stage, because it's like a cuddle. You just like get to hold them and cuddle them and Nova falls asleep when I wear it. So this is definitely an essential, especially if your baby's a little bit fussy and you want to get things done, then you can have both hands. Baby wrap is definitely an essential. Okay, well, well, I feel like I rushed through that because Nova was a little touch and go for part of it. So I'm sorry if it seemed like I was just trying to power through. It's because I was. <laughs> but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave it in a comment down below if any of these were big essentials for you or if you've heard of any of these being big essentials or if you have any to add to the list, um, let me know in the comments down below. But I think I finally got Nova to sleep. Uh, she fell asleep in the bouncer. Look at that sweetie over there. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.